Observe the boy. He is wearing coloured spectacles. Would the coloured spectacles show any difference in the image that he sees? Does the boy notice any difference in the images he sees through the coloured spectacles? At the end of this lesson, you should be able to explain the subtraction of colours by coloured filters. The boy is wearing coloured spectacles. The colour of images that the boy sees will depend on the type of filter he wears. A colour filter is a transparent material that enables a particular coloured light to pass through it. All other colours will be absorbed. The absorption of coloured lights by a filter is known as subtraction of coloured lights. There are two types of filters. There are primary filters and secondary filters. Primary colour filters enables only one primary colour to pass through it. Now, choose the respective filters and observe the colour that appears on the screen. From the simulation above, we could see that primary filter only allows its own colour to pass through the filter. All the other colours are absorbed by a filter. A secondary colour filter only enables its colour and the primary colours that form it to pass through. Let us observe a simulation when a white light passes through a secondary colour filter. When white light passes through a yellow filter, we could see it absorbs all other lights but allows yellow, orange, magenta and red colour to pass through it. When white light passes through a magenta filter, it will allow only red and blue light to pass through it. When white light passes through a cyan filter, it will allow only blue and green light to pass through it. From the simulation, we could see that the secondary filter only allows its own colour and the colour that forms it to pass through. What will happen when we place a primary filter and a secondary filter together? What can you observe on the screen? There is no light captured on the screen. What will happen if we replace the red filter with yellow filter? We could see red colour appear on the screen. So, Using one primary colour filter and one secondary colour filter, it will allow only the primary colour that form the secondary colour to pass through both filters. What will happen when we place two primary filters together? We could not see any colour appear on the screen, because when a white light passes through two primary colours, it will subtract all colours. What will happen when we place two secondary colour filters together? Using two secondary colour filters will allow the colour that is not subtracted to pass through. 
Fill in the blanks with the correct color about subtraction of colored light. Your answer is correct. 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 Click on the correct answer. Absorption of colored lights by a filter is known as A. Reflection of lights B. Refraction of lights C. Dispersion of lights D. Subtraction of lights That's not right. Please try again. Your answer is correct. Observe the diagram. What can be seen on the screen? A. Red light captured on the screen. B. Blue light captured on the screen. C. Cyan light captured on the screen. D. There is no light captured on the screen. Your answer is correct. Based on the diagram, what is the color on the screen? A. Red B. Cyan C. Green D. Yellow That's not right. Please try again. Your answer is correct. A white light passes through a magenta filter and filter X. The color on the screen is blue. Identify filter X. A. Blue filter B. Cyan filter C. Blue or cyan filter D. Blue or magenta filter Your answer is correct. When two primary filters are placed together, what would we see on the screen? A. Red light captured on the screen. B. Blue light captured on the screen. C. There is no light captured on the screen. D. White light captured on the screen. That's not right. Please try again. Your answer is correct. 
diagram shows apparatus to investigate the subtraction of colored lights. White light is shone through two secondary filters. Explain what happens at each filter to produce the result. Click the apparatus for the answer. Yellow filter only allows red and green light to pass through while blue light is absorbed. Cyan filter only allows cyan, blue and green lights to pass through while yellow and red lights are absorbed. Therefore, green light is formed on the screen. Green light appears on the screen. This is because yellow filter absorbed blue light, then cyan filter absorbed red and yellow lights. Explain the result produced if we change the first filter as cyan and second filter as yellow. Click check for your answer. The screen will also show green light. This is because cyan filter will absorb red light and yellow filter will absorb cyan and blue lights. Only green light is allowed. In this lesson, we learned about subtraction of colors by primary colored filters, secondary colored filters. Primary colored filters will absorb all other colors but allow its color to pass through. For example, blue filter will allow blue light to pass through. A secondary colored filter will absorb all other colors but allow the same color and the two primary colors that form it to pass through. Observe the picture. In which industry is this device used? Click the info button to learn more about it. These devices are photographic filters. In photography, filter is a camera accessory. It is used to enhance or to make subtle changes to the images. The images below shows a picture taken using a red filter and without filter. These devices are photographic filters. In photography, filter is a camera accessory. 